What other way to start a bee walk than showing you guys my weird shake in the morning? We have spinach in there. We have my protein hard gainer in there. We have some bananas in there. We also have some things called burro bananas, a burro banana. It is a Mexican banana for apparently donkeys, I guess. Then I'm finishing that thing off with milk, blending this thing up, and I've got my daily quesadilla right there. Shout out, shout out to my brother for uh, giving me this awesome limited limited edition Black Friday My Protein Shaker. Look, it even has like a little black Darth Vader divider thing and everything. The one thing I don't like about this shaker is that as you can see, when you look down inside of it, it literally just turns into a black hole and like when you have pre-workout in it, you cannot tell how much pre-workout you have in here. We pour, we pour, we carefully pour, yes, oh ever valuable nutrients in our mass gainer shake that we need inside of our body. Look at that professionalism. You see the edge of the cup? The actual liquid is crowning just above. That's because I am a professional at pouring mass gainers. Down at the shop now, in case you guys didn't know this, LP is actually a professional detailer. Been detailing cars for like, I don't even know how many years I've been detailing cars. It's like, a lot of years. It's like over 10 years or something like that. Detailing this Bentley right now, this is actually a really pretty car. You guys saw this in a vlog the other day. I'm doing the interior first because I like to do interiors first. That's just how it is. Don't you dare judge me. It's just how I do things. Interesting fact, almost every Bentley you drive, you put the key in on the left side instead of over here, right here on the column. They're almost always right here. I think to present day in the brand new Bentleys, the keys are still always over here. I've shown you inside of one of these cars before on my channel, but in case you're new to the channel, I just want to like show you guys how elaborate and awesome these cars are. Everything in here is wood. Like that's real actual wood. Most little AC vents in cars are made of plastic. Listen to this. Made of metal. Apparently on every single one of these cars, when the, the older ones, all these are handmade, like all this wood stuff, it's all handmade. None of it is manufactured at all. I'm midway done washing this thing. I'm gonna try and show it to you guys without showing the license plate. It's a convertible. This thing is really cool looking. Looks like something out of like a like a movie or something in my opinion. Look at how big the fenders are. The fenders like flare out from the car. It looks really cool. Even in the rear. Look at how much the rear fenders flare out. You could fit like a ton more wheel in there in my opinion. You could put like a big spacer or something and bring the wheel out. A bunch of people probably hate me for saying that, but it looks sweet. Boom, there she is, folks. I am all done with this thing. I, I really just detail these things because they sit at the shop and they get a little bit dirty while they sit at the shop. But what I like to do is kind of take my time on them, kind of spoil them a little bit, give them some tenderness, love and care. Just make them look super good. Uh, this one, I cleaned up the rims really good because they're a little bit filthy. They had a bunch of brake dust on them and stuff. So I just took my time on that. Whenever I detail a car, I like to like, just kind of take my time on the things that I think that the car needs. All right guys, before I leave, Franny just asked for my help. We are about to put this head inside of this Jeep right here. Now, in case you don't understand what a head is, this is basically the top part of your motor. These are valves right here, and essentially what this does is this orchestrates what gas and air does in your engine, essentially. That's the most like rudimentary, simple way of, of explaining this that I can think of. But we're about to put this in the car, and it is a big pain in the butt. So we're about to take this giant chunk of metal and we're about to have to put it right here in this car. Now, what sucks about this is that we have to reach over all of this, get it to line up with these little dowels and everything before it actually slips on and you can finally put the bolts and everything. Oh, it's really slippery right there. Oh, man. Oh, it's slippery right there. Is it really? I'm gonna try and get that low, that rear half supported for okay. you, so that way you don't have to support that. Okay. But we'll let you kind of... Ah. Oh, pull like that down one more. No, no. Oh, okay. One in, oh. two in, yay! Whew. All right, so there she is. She's on there. Now, keep in mind, this is what, a V6 or a V8? V8. This is a V8. So this is only four of the cylinders. The other head is over there. So there's actually two of these heads. We just put on one. Ham, 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 ham. Why? Because I can. All right, guys, at Baby Girl's house now, I'm having this big pile of ham right here, post-workout, or no, wait, excuse me, pre-workout. Then, the other the other day, uh, Baby Girl made these little tiny, you can see how big it is. It's like, it's not much, it's like really small. It's a quiche, 
but it's a tiny little one. So it's kind of like a little quiche, little tiny coin, little coin quiche. Stop pinching my butt when I'm trying to record. <laughs> no. Stop pinching my butt. No. All right, it is a lot of hours later. Baby girl is now home. I waited for her to go work out. Even though it's rush hour uh, at the gym, I decided to wait for her. I'm gonna have this my pre pre workout. Uh, this one is grape flavor. The grape flavor is it's good, but questionable. Also gonna have a scoop. Or, I think I have like a scoop and a half of this citrulline malate. Then there's AAKG powder in here. I know it's not labeled. I just put it in here because the bag that it comes in ends up leaking. Then I'm gonna have a scoop of powder. Ooh, that was a very, very very good workout just now. I haven't worked out in like, uh, I think three or four days, but I was back biceps and triceps. I didn't film anything for you guys because uh, I just didn't feel like it was a very, very crowded gym full of very, very resentful, silly people. Five dollar cookies, 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 five dollar cookies. You're not supposed to be eating things in the store. That's not good. You're not supposed to be eating in the store. <laughs> I feel terrible, guys. I didn't show you baby girl making any of this stuff. She just got done making pasta and this delicious, yummy meat sauce. We are about to eat this. And of course, what else are we gonna watch? Scrubs.